please stand for a moment of silence, followed by the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Teachers, please take attendance and do a quick dress code check. Thank you. for our upcoming wrestling meet against the dreaded yet inferior Perry Meridian Falcons. Our Southport Middle School wrestling team is the best we've ever been. Our goal is to finish is not only one of the best wrestling teams in school history, but one of the best overall teams in school history as well. We've worked hard to win the Marion County Championship and have current record of 19-1. and one. There's just one thing that would make this season even more memorable, and that's you. Students, staff, and families, let's pack the house Thursday, February 23rd for our home meet against Perry Meridian. The meet starts at 5.30 in the SMS Gymnasium, South Gym. Cost of admission is $5 or free with your student ID. This has the makings to be the premier Perry Township Middle School Athletic Event of the Year. We defeated the Falcons once before during the Marion County Wrestling Championship match and plan to annihilate them once again this Thursday. We hope to see you there. Go Cards! Read Across America Week is almost here. Enjoy some special dress days while we celebrate reading. Monday, February 27th is Hats Off to Reading. Wear a school appropriate hat with regular school uniform top and uniform pants. On Tuesday, February 28th, Read to Succeed. Wear your favorite college shirt with uniform pants. On Wednesday, March 1st, team up with a good book. Wear a sports shirt slash jersey with uniform pants. On Thursday, March 2nd, char Character Counts. Wear your favorite book character shirt and uniform pants. Thursday is our library reading. One of your classes may join us in the library to read and enjoy a tree of celebration of Read Across America Day. Then, on Friday, March 3rd, be a super reader. Dress like your favorite superhero with uniform pants. Let's celebrate reading! You've learned in school how Washington, D.C. is home to many amazing sights that tell the incredible story of our country. You're invited to see and feel the history, energy, and impact of our nation's capital with your own eyes. Your days will be packed from morning to night. There's so much to do in Washington, D.C. Inspiring memorials that capture our nation's history. To some of the greatest museums in the world, Smithsonian Museums, United States Holocaust Memorial Museum, the Vietnam Veterans Memorial, Mount Vernon, and many others. You and your friends will create your own memories to share for years to come. students and staff to join us in the fun during Cardinal Up. This is an opportunity to start our Friday with some fun, positive, and joy-filled interactions with the people of SMS. These events will take place every other Friday starting January 13th from 7.30 a.m. to 8 a.m. in the South Gym. It's 
time to purchase your yearbook to remember all the great memories you're making here at Southport Middle School. To purchase your yearbook, click the link in the most recent edition of the Cardinal Chronicle newsletter. The last day to buy a yearbook is February 28th, which is coming soon, so be sure to reserve yours today. I'm Mr. Miller and I'm one of the school counselors. I have a special announcement for our seventh graders today. So eighth grade classrooms, you can go ahead and switch off the announcements now. Seventh graders, we've been having a great year. I hope you finish up strong in our last quarter, continue to do good work. But as we get ready for next year, there's some exciting things to look forward to. And one of those would be what kind of elective classes you're going to take. So this morning, I want to walk you through the process because this is your week to sign up and let me know what you want to take for electives next year. So I'm going to walk you through the process now. First, a reminder to those of you who are in music that we would expect most of you to continue on next year. However, if there's some reason you want to stop your participation, make sure that you've already told your teacher. If not, the absolute deadline is this coming Monday. Now, for the letter that you are to receive in advisory this morning, please make sure that you take this letter home to your parents. Talk with them about your choices, and then you'll need to follow the directions on the letter to complete your preferences in the online form by next Thursday. Make sure as you're doing that that you're logged into your account. Sometimes you might borrow a brother or sister's computer and forget that you're logged into theirs. That's not going to register your choices correctly, and so you won't have your preferences noted. You might get the wrong electives. Lastly, make sure that you double check your choices before clicking submit. However, I want you to know that up until the deadline, you can edit them. So how do you find this link that you need to sign up for electives? Well, first of all, if you go off of the resources page, you can go to the schools tab, follow down to Southport Middle, taking you to our page. Now you can follow along with me and do this, or you can just wait, because remember the link isn't live yet, so you're not actually going to record your preferences right now. Once you're at our school's website, you're going to go over to the counseling tab. The pop-up menu will show, and you'll scroll down to scheduling. On the scheduling tab, not only do you have the link to the choices form, but you also have a lot of information on our electives that we offer here for both 7th and 8th grade. Make sure you're paying attention to the 8th grade ones and look and see if there are some links to videos as well that might help. The other piece of advice I would give you is to ask those who've already had the classes what they thought about them, what kind of information was covered, and so on. Maybe you know an 8th grader or a 9th grader that you could talk to about these. So after looking this over and talking with your parents, then you'll be able to click on the choices form and submit your preferences. And again, those are editable until the deadline, which is next Thursday. Please be sure to take your Chromebooks home each night to charge them so you'll be ready for the next school day. Keep soaring high, Cardinals.